Well, this is a unique game. It's a strategy game about growing a tree and keeping it alive. This is my tree. There's not much to it now, but there's cards I can play that can let me grow branches and roots and other things. Here's a branch card. Let me just get that started. That costs miracles here in the upper left, and I have only three per day. But in addition to growing branches, I can also grow roots, and roots will dig underground and let me access resources such as water and food. And if I touch these waters, I get plus two to my water. That's an important resource. I seem to also be touching this plus one food, which is denoted here. And if I run out of food, I lose. In addition to branches and roots, I can grow leaves on the tree. And leaves can absorb sunlight, which is another valuable resource, whose benefits you will see soon. But I'm out of miracles, so I end the day and the progress shows on the top. I'm progressing through a week. At the end of the week, there is a test fight. I have to defend my tree. Scarabs can defend it, but I'm not ready to defend it now. Instead, I will try to build up my economy with more roots. If I branch out in this direction, I have a bunch of food I could get in the future, and I could build another stem, plus three essence, and I definitely am going to need a lot of stems, because otherwise I won't be able to grow this tree in an ideal manner. And then I'll get another leaf here to set up a sun play. Bring on the next day. But each day has a different weather. Today is dry hot, which means I get less water from each source. Uh, how dare you? I don't like it, but I can't do anything about it. So instead, I'm just going to grow branches. Set that up there. Take another leaf to absorb more sun in the future. And I leveled up. I get to add a new card to my deck. And I'll take this photosynthesis card, convert sun and water into food. It's not something I want to play often, but it is something I want to make sure I can draw often. Because it spends the resources I've accumulated and then gives me food. So I want to save up for a big power play. Instead, I'll grow a flower. And a flower, it grows on the tree. It's cool looking and should hopefully have benefits later. Keep me out of this dry and hot day. And I've collected most of my roots resources, so I got to go and get more. There we go, plus four water. Perfect. Now let's keep digging on this, maybe dig down. Oh, tons of food I just hit, plus five. So then if I want to set up the economy, I think I'm going to need more essence. Let me get it bended out this way. Uh, I'm out of miracles. So again, I want to grow a root. Just try to get to more resources. There is a ton of food down here. It's just going to take a bit to dig to it. I think it's time to try a scarab. Just set up some defenses for the cost of two. Now I want to put this... Maybe right here. So this bug is on the roots. He's got this range of ear to fend off attackers, I guess. He's my homebody. Another day. Ooh, another root I can plant. I mean, roots are the key to the tree. It's how it grows. And it gets me plus 12. Huge food gain. Wonderful. I can also do a combo. Place a leaf. Decorate the tree a bit more. And then sun absorb to get extra sunlight for each leaf I've grown. So plus four sunlight. And now I'm starting to build up the income. So after today, I get to start a battle, but I get extra 50% water from all sources. I definitely want to try to get more water if I can help it. Branch out this way. And then, well, I'm going to need more essence. So I'll grow a tree, <laughs> grow a branch, spend money on a leaf. And I leveled up. I think I definitely need more roots. Yeah, I got to keep branching out to resources. Stems are good too, but I seem to be fine on stems. Now it's the battle. How does this work exactly? Oh, there's actual birds. Birds descending from above, and I've got to use my uh, bird away to send them down, I guess, to knock them out. Okay, so that and maybe plus the scarab can help fight them off. Or maybe the scarab can only fight underground, but they're like attacking the tree. Why do the birds not want the tree to grow? Well, no matter. And I don't have the option to actually skip a card. I don't really want another Scarab card in my deck. I don't know if I need another Photosynthesis. I think two is enough. But instead, I'll just do the draw card card. Zero cost, draw one card. It's a literal do nothing card, effectively. You spend one card to get one card. So at the end of the week, you get a new week. But you also get the roguelike map progression to choose what kind of week it's going to be. I could have a week that's similar to the first. Or I could roll the dice with question marks. And that sounds fun. I got a really confusing weather kind of week. I definitely want to keep building roots if I can. This looks like a good spot. Just send it down this way. And then another root going out could get me more food, even if just a little bit. Then photosynthesis could get me more food, but I'm fine on food. I think I'd rather just get more essence. Yeah, branch out here. 
So now it is a dry and hot day. The water source is terrible. Well, that's fine. I never really planned to get too much water today. Just maybe more stems. Maybe here. The random branchings of the tree are exactly how I want them to be. Well, this root. Maybe just to get food down here. And then if I use grow flower on a flower, it becomes a fruit. That seems interesting. I got an apple. A green apple. Apparently you can harvest them, but I think you need a card to do so. So I'm, it's just an apple right now. But it gets a little redder every day. Well, today is rainy. I get extra water, so I do have plenty. Today I actually might want more sunlight. So I'll start with the leaf. Place that here, maybe. And then get plus six sunlight. So now I could go ham on photosynthesis. Plus 24 food. But I still have a surplus, so I don't really mind. Yeah, I could save photosynthesis and just kind of keep rooting. Yeah, that actually seems like a good advantage. Just keep on digging. I'm out of miracles again. Now it's a cloudy day. What does that mean? Minus 50% sun from all source. Ew. I don't like it, but at least I can just kind of focus on roots. Trying to get to the next food cluster. I also can get myself more essence. If you have a fun little <laughs> doubling back kind of branch. Then maybe another flower for more fruit. I'll have that down here. I like the flowers. They look nice. Damn, I have so much water. Probably should get another scarab, huh, for defense? Yeah, but I've drawn two roots. I feel like I'd much rather just get them down here. Get all the food. Hell yeah. So sun absorb could get me more sunlight. I think I need more sunlight. So this seems like a helpful card for non-rainy days. Honestly, why don't I keep on branching? Get me a little bit closer to even further down. And if I want more sun, then more leaves would help me. Yes, make the tree look nice. Okay, so I can get plus seven sunlight. Oh, but first I need a leaf. Don't need it, but want it. Get plus 50% water from all, all sources. I guess I've actually dried up most of the resources from the ground. I didn't realize that was how that works. Well, I'll take my plus eight sunlight. Do I want another root or a stem? If I do a root, I can dig towards more food. So that's going to be the great decider for me. And day seven. So I don't have much defense. So the apple just fell off the tree. And now there's actually a bunch more food under me because the apple fell. It's an interesting interaction, but helpful when I can't harvest it. So now I get to do the wombo combo. Are you ready for this? Why don't I gain myself plus eight more sunlight? With 28 sun, 38 water, I can just give myself 56 food. This is why I've been saving up for the photosynthesis. Or I could save it for later. <laughs> because I've actually drawn two roots, I'd rather just spend my miracles on roots. Yeah, this is a much more economical idea. Get that down here, connect to more water. Okay, you can get more water from up here. There we go. Yeah, I can photosynthesis any day. I'm not running out of food, but I might be a little nervous after this battle. Where's the pests? Oh, they're down here. Worms, worms in the dirt, dirty worms. Okay, so this is where the scarab could help, but it's kind of out of range because I've extended things too much. Oh, and there's also birds up there too. Oh, great. Okay, so pest controls really got to be working overtime here. Oh, these dirty worms. This scarab I have is useless. Oh, they just ate so many of my roots. Oh, my God. Wait, that's terrible. These guys are assholes. They're the worst. They're the worst. Okay, so I definitely need to put more stock into defense. The birds haven't actually really done anything too annoying. And even if they did, uh, I definitely prefer the birds... Hurting the above ground, the worms hurting the above, uh, below ground. I lost so many roots there. That was messed up. Okay, I'll take another sun absorb card, I guess. Bit of a nightmare scenario. Okay, so note to self, get more defenses. Maybe put them at the tips. Here, I guess I am forced to take a sunny day. Not gonna complain. All right, though, I still have some good roots. No, I am actually out of grow essence. So I need a stem. Interesting, okay. Get one up there. Now I can root out my problems. And I think I'm going to make it towards this pack of food in the middle, eventually. Oh, and I got a rainy day. Nice. Oh, sun, sun absorb cards. Well, yes, I will just stockpile sunlight then. Don't mind if I do. And I do have only one essence less left, so I guess I'll make this stem right now. Just suck it up. Oh, I can't place it there. That's a dead end. The tree cannot overlap with itself. The stem uh, branch could go out next day. Okay, so I definitely need scarabs. I'm gonna get the next one above ground, but like way up here. That way I can fend off against the birds. And now I am starting to get a little low on food. I lose nine per turn. So I think it's time to just cash out with photosynthesis. Yeah, especially since I don't have roots. Here we go. 
The big, big 105 food. Oh, I've got nothing to worry about for a fat minute. Okay, I did draw photosynthesis. I was worried I wouldn't, but I did. So I guess I didn't need to. That's all right. I definitely wanted to get roots. Now, unfortunately, I can only afford so many roots. Ooh, I got an achievement. That was really loud. Oh, getting this achievement gave me a bonus maximum miracle. So now I can spend four per turn. Oh, I didn't know that's how that worked. Interesting. What else can I do? Grow more leaves, harvest three apples, defeat pests, grow flowers. You know, I am gonna use grow flower, but I think I actually wanna upgrade this to an apple again for food's sake, which doesn't help with the progress, but at it's 10. There's no way I'm getting 10. Instead, I'll just get more underground foods. That's a pretty good day. Okay, now I can spend so much more. Definitely, I'm gonna need more essence. Throw that out there, leveled up. Ooh, spawn caterpillars for defense. I think I'm gonna need more defense, so caterpillar seems helpful. And then, okay, I can get a ton of sunlight right now. Start with the leaf, my tree's looking pretty naked, and then get casual plus nine. And either plus nine again or a branch root. I'm actually feeling branch root right now. Yeah, just because I have a lot more sun than water. Yeah, give me the root. Get a lot more food, plus six. Next day is looking to be dry hot. No, never mind. Today is the extra water source. Oh, oh, even better. Okay, well, in that case, we'll go for a branch root. Maybe here? Just angle down, get more water. Yes, good. I think I want a scarab down here to defend. Oh, I'm out. Out of essence. Well, that's okay. I have a wise stem I can play. Now I can afford the scarab because I guess yeah, they, they, they cost you for defending the homeland, but they are quite good at it. Yeah, I'm going to want as many forces as possible defending the land. Okay, now I can go for more sun. But my main issue right now is I'm missing out on grow essence. Yeah, all I can really do actually is grow a flower. Maybe here. Can't afford a caterpillar. I guess I'll just do a root. Do that straight down. Touch on even more water. Take up even more sunlight. And then go to the synthesis for the food since I got nothing else to do. Back up over 100. Oh, it's battle time. Well, let's see if I'm well prepared against these pests. Probably going to be a nuisance. God, they're coming from above and below. Uh-oh. Okay, so I got to focus on some of these. The worms. Okay, the scarab's handling that at the bottom. Just kind of keep pestering these away. Oh, there's a lot up here. All right, they seem to, like, get stunned whenever I spray them. So I should use that to my advantage. Come on, scarab. You got this, buddy. You can do it. Any other worms down here? None that I can see. There's a big bird. Mama bird's here. Well, you can keep stunning her for a bit. Let the scarab work at her. Anything down here? Worm's dead. So is Mama Bird. Good. Gain plus two extra resource from root absorption. Or a wasp. Well, that costs three essence. I don't know, man. I think root absorption seems pretty good. So I'm going to try that. But I will play scarabs whenever I get the chance. So week four. I definitely don't want more pests from what it looks like. So I'll take the question marks. Roll the dice. Seems like it's a bunch of weird weather patterns. Interesting. The bad news, I'm still out of essence. Can't really do much about that. I can always get more resources. Plus two. I can gain some sunlight. I can gain some food with photosynthesis. And I'm out of stuff. Okay, fruit fell down. That should give me more food down there. Very nice. Okay, good news for me. I got stem straight. The tree can still grow. One of my leaves has been partially chewed on. It's kind of interesting. Also use this grow flower to get a fruit, which should take a while before it falls, huh? And then a bit more sunlight. Uh, unless if I want to do the leaf first. I actually don't want to do the leaf. Yeah, doing the leaf right now is bad because I don't need extra sunlight and I need my grow essence and leaves cost grow essence. So it's better to not do anything here. Okay, another grow essence. Good. Pop that right here by the scarab. One that's already defending. Speaking of the scarab, I think I'll get another one for the sky. Be right here. I can't afford a caterpillar, but oh well. Then, well, one miracle left. I guess I'll sun absorb. Now, maybe I'll come across more water in the future, but no roots, so that's not happening now. Okay, speaking of roots, there is a ton of water up here to the left that I definitely want to encroach on. Hmm, got to figure out the best spot. From here, it actually doesn't let me build up because there's a rock in the way. Guess I'll just take the water that's here, absorb some extra stuff from the roots. Then I think it's a scarab. Definitely need one. Down here is pretty good. Now I got both the ends covered. Having four energy is so nice. Oh, fantastic. I can get even more essence. Exactly what I needed. Caterpillar, finally, on a leaf for good defense. Put that maybe close to the chewed leaf. What does this guy do? Oh, he's got a huge range. Oh, I can attack anywhere. Nice. 
Okay, in that case, I'll just keep branching with the roots. Maybe down here. So I want things to give me plus sun. Actually, I don't need it though. I have a huge excess in sun. Here, yeah, I just want straight root. I'm actually gonna branch this way because it sets up a better root play in the future. Also, I'm gonna need more stems. Maybe out like that. Very imbalanced tree, but it's the way I like it. And again, I don't want to spend essence, so I guess I'm just gaining a ton of sunlight. Maybe it'll come in handy one day, but probably not. Okay, awesome. The apple fell. More food for me. Okay, so there's a battle today. Well, I definitely want to get another caterpillar down then. Maybe plop that here. Yeah, like right in the middle of the tree, just so it can attack everywhere. Definitely going to want that branch root. It right here. Oh, a plus 12. Yeah, that's nice. And then with my last energy, I guess I'll just take a flower, get food in the future. Oh, level up. Well, I could harvest fruit. Interesting. And then fruit lets me get another possible card selection. Could be good. I also like the ability of the fruit to fall and just give me food, though. That seems almost preferable. Either way, I think I'm ready for a battle here. Bring on the pests. Yep, yep, yep. Get some free shots off of these birds. The worms may be coming. I gotta pay attention to those, too. Actually, I probably should. No, okay, no worms coming. Focus on the birds. Come on. Come on. Go away. I don't want to die. It's kind of funny, you know, this game's about building a tree, preserving nature, but we're out here killing birds. In my defense, they attacked first. Oh, there's a boss worm, too. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, my scarabs down here has been doing good work. That was nothing. 2x extra resource from root absorption. Whoa. Or a wasp. I don't need a wasp. Sunny weather? I don't need more sun. I'll take 2x resources, especially with water. Oh, sick. I defeated 40 pests, that's what that sound effect was. So now I got five miracles per turn? Hell yeah. So now the week five, the boss week. Gotta get through this. So I'm collecting all the underground water I can, except I'm out of essence. Well, thankfully I have a Y stem. I think this tree needs more on the left side. Right, now I can get those branch roots going. Right here, yep. And then a straight root over here as well. Really, yeah, tap into that. A little extra, extra absorption. I don't think I need a leaf. I just need to make sure I get enough food. Oh, plus 76 food. That's a pretty good way to do it. Let me at least start with more stems. Good build out. Yeah, I really don't need more leaves. I'll just take more sunlight. The sunlight extra doesn't matter because you spend extra sun and extra water in order to get food, which is at 136 right now. We are very, very well fed. And any leftovers just get unspent. Right now I'm looking for more defense. Double absorption. Ooh, too bad I just dried up most of the water. But actually, I am still collecting a lot from all this. Let's see what I could do. I could get another branch root down. Can I hit this water? I can. Then I can double the absorption. Yes. And take another scarab. Feels like my underground's mostly covered. If I lose a couple of roots, I'll live. I might want more bird defense, though. Yeah, scarab that's further out there. Because that's the main thing, right? Just being able to afford defense. So I guess I'll take a fruit here. Definitely more stem straight. Throw it up there. More caterpillar defense. Get them on the leaves just in the middle. And oh, interesting. Actually, I'm low on sunlight, but can't I always sun absorb? I think I'll just take the extra absorb because it's fine value right now. Uh, okay, let's see. I'm getting a ton of water today. Well, I'm definitely doubling the absorption rate, of course. Where can I get with two roots? Uh, real quick, a little extra sunlight. I am building two roots. Just gotta figure out where. If I make it towards the big chunk of food down here, that'd be legendary, but I don't know if it'll reach. Oh, yes. Perfect. Just barely. That's what I like to see. Yep, I'm loaded. More scarabs? Don't mind if I do. Probably need one way down here. Except I don't have enough essence, so never mind on that. In fact, the only thing that I have that doesn't cost essence is photosynthesis. For over 200 food. And I'll play it again for the hell of it. Oh, it doesn't even let me. Nice. Okay, so I could harvest the fruit. You know what? Give me the fruit. Sure. One fruit. See if that matters. Okay, one of the final stems. If I want, I can root something. Let's see. Is there any way I can pick up more stuff? Let's see. If I go down here, I can get more food at least. I suppose I can get more sunlight, more food, end on 211. See how I do against this boss battle. All right, where is it? What is that? A ram? Oh my god, he's got the horns! He's buttoned at the tree! No, he's not. We got him. Unless there's one on the ground, too. Oh, there, there's two of them! Oh no. Ah, no, 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 no. What is this? You stop this immediately. You stay back. 
Stay away from my tree. I worked so hard to grow this thing. Still going. Oh god, okay, they're both coming from the same side. This is better because I can hit them both with the same shot. But it might mean they actually do some damage now. No, they haven't actually even broken a single thing off my tree yet. My tree, tree's got a big green health bar. Hey, let's go. Let's go. I don't think I need more miracles. I will unlock more cards for, ooh, double absorption. Hell yeah. Does the game keep going? Ah, it is just the demo. So that's a cool spot to end it. What a unique game. <laughs> if there's enough to justify another video, I'll record it. So thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you all in the next one. Have a wonderful day and peace.